Explore underwater aquatic environments and you know these students at Carroll High are going to have it good this morning because they're going to be diving into it all. Aquatics teacher Dr. Heidi Ballou joins us now live. I'm assuming I'm pronouncing your last name wrong so please correct me when you get a chance but if you could how did this idea come about for you and what's the ultimate purpose? Yeah, so I am a scuba diver myself and I've uh, dove a lot of different places uh, in the U.S. and then uh, across the world and it has opened up a lot of different experiences for me. And when I was teaching my students this year, I felt like this was an opportunity and an experience that I felt like they needed to have uh, so that it can broaden their perspective. So my goal is to get them under the water today, see if they like it, and then hopefully they'll want to continue doing this um, after they leave Carroll High School. The students, I would imagine they're excited. Are there some a little timid, maybe a little worried? How do you calm their fears and how do you prepare them for getting submerged underwater with only a tank on your back to breathe? Yeah, there's a lot of nervous energy, but a lot of excitement as well. So yesterday I uh, prepared them with lots and lots of instructions and tutorials and giving them uh, a run through of everything that would happen today so that they have all of the expectations in front of them and they are fully prepared. So today they've got um, amazing instructors, instructors that are helping them uh, get ready to get in the water and breathe underwater. You have a scuba venture that's uh, helping get this venture going. Uh, for these students. Where do they go from here? What's next? Is this to show them what careers are out there or the fact that most of what of the underwater has not been explored yet? Yeah, so a little bit of both. We talked a lot about what you can do with scuba diving, including um, industry, so oil and gas exploration uses underwater welding. Um, obviously, recreational diving is huge, you know, just going to see what is under the water. And then, uh, you know, scientific diving is a big thing as well. And so as a scientist, scientific diving is something that I've done myself. And so I'm hoping that this will just open up a lot of different opportunities for them to explore. And hopefully they'll want to continue diving um, after this experience. Well, Dr. Ballou, thank you so very much for taking some time this morning to visit with us. Uh, this is certainly a course I never had offered uh, when I was in high school. So this is a great opportunity for these kids, and we can't wait to see what else. Oh, well, there we go. The kid just dove right in. I would go back. That's how I rolled.